It is Danny Sunshine Bauer and I am so excited. I'm here at the, the Hyatt with the coolest, some of my education heroes, just wonderful school leaders and we're collaborating on something called hashtag ed right now this is volume number two that will be available i believe in uh december 2018 uh, but we're working together to talk about connection about culture building about building relationships so that we could create world-class organizations within our schools and districts so in just a second i'm going to interview very short uh, some of my peers that are collaborating on this project uh, but first we'll talk to jeff zoll who will give us the background of how he even gathered this Avengers group of school leaders as well as the history of Ed Right Now and the Will to Live Foundation that, listen, we're not making any money off of this project. It's about a passion, it's about will to live. And we'll talk about that in just a sec. Hello, I'm Jeff Zoll. I'm one of the uh, original co-creators of the Ed Right Now movement. We began this last summer uh, in 2017 with 10 educators from around the country and we gathered uh, a few days before the National Principals Conference, so we met in Philadelphia where the conference was held. Uh, this year we're just about to wrap up volume two of the Education Right Now movement. Uh, so excited about this for a number of reasons. So this year we have 10 people, educators from around the world this year actually, meeting uh, and, the, and what happens is, and we're doing this in Chicago this year, is that these 10 educators come across from all parts of the world or country and we write a book in 48 hours. Uh, we write a full length book, which is about 50,000 words. And the charge for each participant is to come up with a 5,000 word chapter. And of course, we try to interconnect these chapters and we come up with a theme each year. Last year's theme was all about change and the changes we need to make in education. So the overall goal is in, in 48 hours, we write a book of about 50,000 words with each of the 10 participants and educators um, writing a 5,000 word chapter. And we, we meet periodically throughout the process to make sure that these chapters are you know, connecting along the theme. And this year we're writing about relationships and connections and school culture and how to build a culture of connecting with our kids, with each other, uh, with the community, and with all members of the school community and the schoolhouse. So it's a really, really, really rewarding and exciting uh, 48 hours. It's action packed, There's a little bit of pressure. I remember participating last summer and this summer and uh, it's a little bit of uh, a push to get those 5,000 words completed in, uh, in 48 hours. And it's kind of fun to see how the 10 different educators approach the task and you get to see the different writing styles and writing habits and train and the way that people write and approach their chapter. But we intentionally uh, schedule into the day times to come back, uh, both with individuals. We have what we call writing accountability partners and we kind of assign those randomly. So throughout the two days, every few hours, we have a, a accountability partner one-on-one -on -one, and we kind of help each other if we're struggling or just listen to how it's going. And then also periodically throughout the two days, we stop and we have people read aloud uh, parts of their chapters and get feedback from their colleagues. So that's been kind of fun. And then at the very end, we'll each read our last paragraph of our chapter uh, to the rest of the group and get any final feedback and we'll be on our way. And then uh, from between now and the time the book is published, we'll be kind of promoting the idea and the concept. We'll write blog posts about our chapters. And then hopefully, just like last year, the book will be in print uh, on December 1st of this year, 2018. You know, so the, so the final really cool thing about the Ed Right Now movement is this. Uh, no one who participates on the team earns a dime on this project. In fact, it costs us money. Uh, participants pay their own travel. Uh, we do have a publisher, Routledge uh, Ion Education, who sponsors our hotel rooms and meals. But the people who are doing this do it from um, passion, do it from a desire to make a contribution to the profession and to society, and uh, they actually pay their own way to get here and it costs uh, some people a lot of money. Uh, we have team members this year from, believe it or not, Belgium. Mm -hmm. uh, we have two from Texas. We have one from California. We have one from Pennsylvania. Uh, we have one from North Carolina. I'm from Chicago, so this year I didn't have to travel. Uh, but it's a great, diverse team. We try to get people with different roles, 
frankly, different genders, different races, different uh, perspectives, and what they bring to the field of education. We all come together to write this book. And as I say, the royalties for this book uh, go to an organization that I'm very passionate about. So I just want to say a little bit about the Will to Live Foundation. Uh, last year, all royalties from this book will, uh, will go to Will to Live Foundation, and that'll happen again this year, and hopefully in the future as we continue the Ed Right Now movement. Will to Live Foundation is an amazing organization. It's a nonprofit organization dedicated to raising awareness and hopefully preventing teen suicide. It was started by a remarkable man named John Troutwine. John happens to be a friend of mine uh, from the Chicago area. Many, many years ago, we attended high school together. Although we weren't that close at the time, we've stayed in touch uh, through his work. And his work is something I encourage educators, anybody in, in the world, frankly, to be aware of. Because I think suicide is something that in some way, shape, or form impacts us all. And the work he's doing after the tragic suicide of his own 15-year-old son, whose name was Will, uh, is frankly changing the landscape of teen suicide awareness and prevention. So we think it's a noble cause. We think you'll think that as well if you take a look at it. Um, look at the Will to Live Foundation. And thanks for supporting the Ed Right Now movement. This has been, I've, I've told the teams both years uh, after doing this, uh, probably the highlight of my education career after 35 years in public school service. So thanks for uh, uh, taking part and taking an interest in the Ed Right Now movement. Hey, so this is Danny Sunshine. I hope you really enjoyed this video. And I love how Jeff broke down how he uh, assembled the team, what the purpose of Ed Right Now, volume one and two is all about. And then the really important work that we're doing. We're doing it from our hearts, the passion, but we're doing it to benefit this incredible foundation called the Will to Live organization. Uh, so check them out. They'll be linked in the details uh, description of this video. And if you got any value at all and you got excited about what we're doing with Ed right now, check us out on Amazon. You can pick up Volume 1. Volume 2 will be available December 1st, 2018. And share this video. Give it a thumbs up. Click subscribe or follow. And then for the comment, the question of the day is what is your go-to strategy for building deep relationships? Because that's a bit of what we dug into uh, over the last two days in terms of connecting because relationships matter to people.